Eagles singer Don Henley is fighting back, filing a lawsuit in New York to reclaim his handwritten notes and song lyrics from the legendary Hotel California album. The lawsuit, lodged in Manhattan Federal Court on Friday, follows the sudden dismissal of criminal charges against three collectibles experts accused of plotting to sell these prized documents. The charges were dropped in March, right in the middle of the trial. Henley, steadfast in his belief that the pages were stolen, had promised to take legal action after the criminal case against rare books dealer Glenn Horowitz, former Rock and Roll Hall of Fame curator Craig Inciardi, and rock memorabilia seller Edward Kosinski was halted. Released in 1977, Hotel California is a monumental album, ranking as the third best-selling in U.S. history. These 100 pages of personal lyric sheets belong to Mr. Henley and his family, and he has never authorized defendants or anyone else to peddle them for profit, stated Henley's lawyer, Daniel Petrocelli. According to the lawsuit, the handwritten pages are currently in the possession of the Manhattan District Attorney's Office, which has yet to comment on the case. Kosinski's lawyer, Sean Crowley, fired back, accusing Henley of making false claims. He argued that the criminal charges were dropped because Henley had misled prosecutors by withholding crucial information that showed Kosinski had bought the pages in good faith. Don Henley is desperate to rewrite history, Crowley said. We look forward to litigating this case and bringing a lawsuit against Henley to hold him accountable for his repeated lies and misuse of the justice system. Lawyers for Inciardi and Horowitz were unavailable for comment. Horowitz isn't named in the lawsuit as he does not claim ownership of the materials. During the trial, defense attorneys argued that Henley had given the lyric pages decades ago to a writer working on a never published Eagles biography. This writer allegedly sold the handwritten sheets to Horowitz, who then sold them to Inciardi and Kaczynski. They began auctioning the pages in 2012. The criminal case unraveled after prosecutors admitted that the defense had been blindsided by 6,000 pages of communications involving Henley and his legal team, revealed only after Henley waived attorney-client privilege at the last minute. Judge Curtis Farber, overseeing the non-jury trial, remarked that witnesses and their lawyers used attorney-client privilege to obfuscate and hide information that they believed would be damaging and that prosecutors were apparently manipulated. Please subscribe for more celebrity news. Stay safe and be happy.